Greetings. Yo, the black light, once again, the brother like no other. Let's get right to it. Suckers born every minute. You better think about this world created by the cockazoid that you're living in. Don't forget, it wasn't too long ago you were in physical bondage. Then you became in mental bondage. Anytime you are denied education for three or four hundred years, you excluded to use your original tongue, your original names. You don't know who your God is. You don't know what your culture is like. And then they tell you that you are free. And then they start educating educating you in their school system to be dummy down. So today you don't have no more businesses, grocery stores, you know. And think about it. The Caucasian own every business you could think of every kind of money-making proposition you could think of the Federal Reserve which is backed by the Illuminati that's their old name they got a new one now and uh, they still you know ran by the Rothschilds and Rockefellers and the Zionists the biggest gangsters that there ever was. And so, you're still being run by them. I don't watch sports no more. And any kind of sports, I don't watch it. It's a sucker's move. It's a sucker's move. These brothers are getting paid to damn near try to kill each other. You know. They make millions of dollars, then they give it right back, buying mansions, cars that cost uh, money, too much money, you know, cars that cost uh, millions and millions of dollars, you know, right back to the Caucasian instead of going back helping your people you suckers and, and those who pay for it is suckers y'all pay for these U2 all stars cause a brother talk about another brother you know it's a, it's a negro move a nigga move you know they they, they uh the white man made us niggas. But we really are gods. You know. And you say, well, Ali. Well, Y'all don't know that Ali, the Honorable Elijah Muhammad, told Muhammad Ali to stop fighting and be a minister. Because it don't look right you trying to kill your brother. You know beat up on the whitey that's good <laughs> but you can't try to kill your brother that ain't too good you know so you damn near killed that brother Earl damn near killed him he, he, he was already living a wild lifestyle that's why he crashed his car you know money went to his head you, you, you can get any woman you want because they're attracted by money you know and you don't put it back in your neighborhood you are going by a city you know you could you all that money y'all making y'all could buy a city y'all could pay the pay the mayor to jump to uh, jump to your ho hoops, you know, 
but ultimately the money belongs to the Federal Reserve. You, you are, he is, the Federal Reserve is leasing the money out to you. You see? Now Allah, there's a fire burning in Las Vegas right now. People are evacuating their homes. You know? These brothers are beating up on each other. You know? Now Allah is in the mix. You know, he's incredible heat wave, not just in the United States, some parts of the United States, but all over the planet. You know, incredible heat wave. Now, uh, since Ali, you know, refused to give up boxing, uh, he got from the he got from out from under protection of Allah, cause y'all realize Muhammad took his name away. He was back to cash his clay and suspended from the temple. That's why he went with Wallace. You see, and then you see what happened. He was, he was inflicted with a plague, you know? And it is said that the Caucasian poisoned him, you know? The Caucasian allows you to make so much money, like Bill Cosby and whatever. They're gonna find some kind of way to knock you off. Michael Jackson, you know? Especially if you don't dance by their tune. The minute you start getting headstrong and thinking you got all the money, you ain't you don't own that money. All those foreign uh, leaders like Gaddafi, Hussein, and all them, they had money over here. They put a restriction on it. His brothers right over here right now. That if they got, they, they go to cash a check. Check might be worth a hundred thousand dollars, ten thousand dollars, six thousand dollars. And the bank ain't gonna cash it. They don't want to cash it. Y'all don't heard seen stories like that, you know. And the dope man, they think they doing good. They gonna make so much money, then they gonna get busted. This a rigged system, y'all. And all y'all who buy into it, who buy into the stock market, you know, y'all suckers, you know. Yeah, y'all think y'all living good because y'all could pay y'all light bills and stuff, but they're getting ready to end that with the Fed Now program. You know, they're going to control your money through their car. Then what you going to do? The brothers ain't telling you what they're going to do. They just, you know, working for the, for the Caucasian. Yeah, they working for them. You know, they working for the Caucasian. And... They are paid, they're agents, to keep you beefing among yourself, shooting you, up, shooting you up, putting guns in your neighborhood so you can kill each other. Instead of y'all trying to unite and talk about the Caucasian, y'all y'all throwing each other up under the bus. Look at uh, Donald Trump. And Biden, Allah is putting that on them because they're confused. They're going to have a civil war. Stay tuned for part three. Assalamu alaikum.